little little kitsch here or here or here but this unit is not so sensitive for the leakage oh yeah and that was the problem the displacer was on the side so I, I just pulled the tube see what's happened so it start free oh Jesus you see <laughs> very good Hello everyone, this is Blade and this is Blade's World. Today I want to show you the next step. So after when when the unit worked in the first time for my friend Tipshin, he's talking about a lot how we can use this power. If it's possible with fluid, it's possible with piston too. And maybe the first guy was a raise attack or something like that. After Tipshim's experiment, he wants to use only a tube like this. This is a really tiny latex tube, and he just connected with the with the coke. Maybe put the regenerative displacer in and connected with the rod like this, just in the middle, and use latex power membrane. And it was the whole thing. He connected the tube on the side and just heat it up and it starts to moving and that was the first time when we see the thermoacoustic metronome water engine I don't know how, how we can call it but now I want to show you how that works so we have a tube and um, probably and then we have another tube more than two meters I want to fix them. And try to heat them. That's a good sign. What's happened here? This is a fluid in also, but <laughs> with a gas piston. The gas piston has mass and the mass going back and forth. So the pressure increasing. And when the pressure higher than the gas resistance in the tube, then the gas start to Go out. It looks like an open unit, but the gas never go out from the unit because the expansion, maybe in this section, we fill up with the, the gas from the unit, but the other gas from the outside. So it's never changed going back and forth with laminar flow. So this is a closed unit but not exactly because we lost the power of the air piston. The air piston has big movement and it has a momentum that we can't use. But if I use the other side with the piston, when the gas expands, then here is the sticky point, but the gas wants to expand more. The small piston moves the crankshaft away from the sticky point and then it, this piston changed the cycle because the 
power piston starts to go down and the gas starts to go up to the cold side and contract so it sag in the piston with the high power but in the bottom side bottom sticky point we have a suction in this side and you see we have 90 degrees so when we have no uh, power from here we have power from here and that move forward the crankshaft with the flywheel and change the cycle to the positive guys i hope you enjoy this if you want to support my efforts just use my patreon or join my group behind the youtube and if you have any questions don't hesitate to ask me i hope i can help you and i think for the next time that will be a step-by-step -step tutorial for the first Manson unit that I made from a beer can. See you soon. It was Blade.